Kate renews her lifelong affair with quintessential part of the English summer. Duchess has only missed one Wimbledon since marrying William as she and Meghan head to Centre Court for women's final day today. The Duchess of Cambridge is set to make another annual trip to her beloved Wimbledon this year to watch the women's final alongside Meghan Markle. The pair were spotted at the tournament last year during their first public appearance together, also at the women's final. The Royals, both 37 will be on hand to watch Meghan's close friend Serena Williams take on Romanian player Simona Halep on center court this afternoon. While the pair have both been spotted at the tournament separately this year, Meghan's appearance sparked controversy after fellow spectators were banned from taking pictures of her. Her team insisted it was a private outing, despite taxpayers forking out pounds 2.4 million for renovations to her new home. Kensington Palace declined to comment. But a royal source told Mail Online, it's not uncommon for personal protection officers accompanying any members of the royal family to ask people not to take pictures so they can engage with people and events rather than camera phones. A firm fan of the sport, it is believed Kate has only missed Wimbledon once, in 2013 when she was heavily pregnant with Prince George. And the Duchess used to queue for hours hoping to get into the grounds and Henman Hill before she had access to the royal box. She was first publicly pictured at Wimbledon as Prince William's girlfriend in 2007 when she attended with one of her friends. In 2008 she returned to the courts again with her friend Sophie Carter to watch Rafael Nadal beat Nicholas Kiefer in the third round of the men's singles. While she wasn't pictured attending in 2009 and 2010 her love of what she calls the quintessential part of the English summer suggests she would have been watching. After her marriage to Prince William in April 2011 she made her first royal appearance at Wimbledon just a few months later in June. And since then the only thing to have stopped her attending the oldest tennis tournament in the world was her being heavily pregnant with Prince George in 2013. In a BBC interview with Sue Barker in 2017 Kate revealed how she begged her doctor to let her go to the final between Andy Murray and Novak Djokovic and even wrote to the victorious Brit to apologize for her absence. She told how she was inspired by great tennis players such as Pete Sampras and Joran Ivanisevic and revealed that every time she watches Wimbledon she thinks, yes, I could do the same. Recalling her first ever visit to the All England Lawn Tennis and Croquet Club, where Wimbledon is held, she revealed she queued for so long that she didn't get in until late in the day but luckily play went on quite late. Talking of how inspired she gets while watching the talented players at Wimbledon she said she always thinks she can do the same and get out the racket but admitted sadly never with the same results. It will be the second time in less than a week that the Duchesses will have stepped out together following their family day out to the polo on Wednesday. Kate and Meghan brought along their children to watch William and Harry go head-to-head -head in Wokingham, Surrey. It marked two-month-old Archie's first public event. 